In this video, we will simulate propane refrigeration loop. Add the component. Click on add button. Black propane. Add it. Choose the plate package. Click on add button. The fluid package is Pang Robinson. It's okay. Now go to simulation environment. Click on a cooler. Place it here. Then Go to Pressure Changer tab, select a valve, place it here, then a compressor, place it here, now select a heater and place it here. Okay. Double click on this cooler. The name of the cooler is Condenser. The inlet stream is stream number 4. And the outlet stream is stream number 1. The energy is on Q in the parameter. The delta P is thirty five kilopascal. Now double click on this valve that is JT valve inlet is stream number 1 the outlet is stream number 2 close this one also now double click on this heater the name of the equipment is Chiller Inlet is stream number two and the outlet is stream number three. So we write there three. The energy is chill Q. Go to the parameter. The delta P is only 7 kilopascal. Now double click on this compressor. The inlet is stream number 3. Outlet is stream number 4. And the energy is HP Now do the rearrangement work click on this JT valve and press 1 to rotate it Okay Now this chiller press the 2 button to rotate it Now double click on stream number 1, provide the necessary detail like uh, the vapor fraction is 0 and the temperature is 50 degree 
and propane is 1. Okay. Similarly, stream number 3. Vapor fraction is 1 and temperature is minus 20. Okay. Now go in the chiller energy stream. Double click on it and provide the value. It is 1 exponent 6 kilojoule per hour. Let us solve now. You can see that how the information is transferred in forward and backward direction in a Aspen Heist software. We solve this loop with a very minimum information. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you.